I've been in this field now for more than 30 years and I like it just as much now as I did when I started. I think that's, that's pretty cool. And why is that? Well, partly because the, the subject matter of social psychology is all the stuff that interests me. And so social psychology gives me the tools and to answer sort of questions about the human condition that I've always wanted to know about. What I love about social psychology is that it allows us to be both the scientist and the subject. It allows us to understand ourselves in a different way um, by doing experiments on human behavior that allow us to under, better understand why we behave the way we do. Another aspect of social psychology that is really unique is that we can also um, apply what we know to understanding things like elections and election outcomes. We can uh, apply it to policy. So we can work at things at the macro level. And unlike most disciplines, social psych is that gateway. You can go up a level, you can go down a level, and you can actually integrate all three levels to make a change in the world. I think for me, the fact that you can understand human behavior through experiments, through science, um, was, 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 I just had a wow uh, a reaction to it. Um, and especially, I think, as an 18-year-old, um, when the findings were counterintuitive, when it didn't fit with what my hunch was. Um, and that, to me, just blew me away. And over time, I, I realized it's, although social psychology is a lot of fun intellectually, it's great to do experiments and collect data and verify your theories and it's a good process. It's also really gratifying to be able to apply those theories and find that you can take the data that's collected in the laboratory sometimes in which you think this has no practical implications. But it turns out it does, that it has great value for solving specific problems. One of the things that I think is so great about this particular field of psychology is how relevant it is to so many different domains of life. So social psychology, in a sense, reinvents itself in new domains. Um, if you bring five social psychologists together on anything, we'll never agree. But that's the, that's the beauty of it, because I always learn from my disagreements with people. Um, and so what I like is about the way we do the work that we do that we're open to different views, that we learn from one another, um, that we continue to reinforce one another, both by agreeing but by disagreeing with one another. So I think that the field has a real opportunity for intellectual and personal growth um, just by the way we do things. So I think social psychology is alive and well, and it's increasingly relevant for today's world. So I think it has a robust future ahead. I like the fact that our work has impact. Mm -hmm. That's what keeps it exciting now. You're going to love this field and you're going to love this class. That's what I tell my students on the first day. You're going to love this class and you're going to remember it. I get letters from students that I had decades earlier saying, I'm still using stuff I learned in this class. So you're going to love it. <laughs>